Let's talk about the Proud Fairy reboot. Let's talk about the feminist ultimate woke bullshit. This is going to be a milking the cow. Once again, milking the same cow from the original. Milking the cow from the other products that Disney trying to denounce in the other day that I find out. Even though they're going to make Toy Story 4, I mean 5, uh, whatever. But this shit is caught my attention. Less caught my attention. Are you kidding me, Disney? Like, like louder and proud, prouder? Are you fucking kidding me, Disney? Fuck, how long to go reboot everything that we love, used to love back in the day? They don't care about us main fans. They care about money. <laughs> they and they put and they put some weird shit out of this reboot show. And there's gonna be no sticky. I heard that that they are not gonna put sticky in this reboot because of the actor who played the character of Sticky. Not gonna be in this reboot show. They cut him off because of what the actor what the actor did. I just found out I did not know what the actor did. And the other besides that, but besides that, but ugh, the show. Oh my god, they put the fucking weird out of the show. They pull a cook rap feminist agenda and put some gay shit woke. Bullshit in this TV series reboot. This this is actually this is sick. This is disgusting. This is what I was meant about about Elger Miller as the Flash that I heard about him. He do something really wrong, disgraceful all his life. This is terrible. That I respect it. Oh my God! Who actually thought about this? Who came bring this show back and means nothing? All that from the OG original series means nothing. Nothing. How do we deserve this for our punishment, Hollywood? Hollywood is running out of goddamn ideas once again, once more. They run out every idea. Disney will go, how long to go milk out of this every same series that we used to love? How long to go milk out all this? Oh my God, this is so terrible. Oh my God. Oh, sickening. This is sickening, man. Fuck. Hollywood lost their balls all, all this. Ah, oh, oh my god. <sighs> all right, all right, wipe below. Tell me what y'all think. Do y'all go watch this Proud Family reboot? Or oh, y'all go trying to do them have okay or don't mind with it or whatever? Just wipe below. Tell me what you think. But I'm about to be pissed off, pissed off if I'm gonna see. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, hold on a sec. I'm gonna be. Reminding y'all about y'all kids. Don't ever watch this for your if you have kids for watching this shit. Don't want your kids to watch this shit for this new generation. I, I beg of you. I'm you're guaranteed. You're guaranteed fucking T. Alright, then again, wipe below. Tell me what y'all think. Y'all know what I'm saying, but so yeah, uh, this this is actually this is this show is actually absolutely disgrace to the proud famous le every character's legacy that we used to love. This is this show is that gonna be a piss me the fuck off with if I'm gonna end up watching this. But I'm gonna give a fair shot. But yeah, wipe below, tell me what y'all think. Am I out? Oh, before I end this video, if the Kim Possible reboot animated series go come back, if they go bring that animated series of the Kim Possible, Leo Stitch, etc., 
that would be so dead weight for these characters. Uh, let, let's say Kim Possible. If Kim Possible get a reboot, that's that's be your biggest warning that you've never known. That's gonna be evil. <laughs> then again, and I'm out. But then again, that's gonna be our punishment right there. Blame Disney for this. Do not watch this TV series. Do not let your kids watch this. You don't want to know what they put in all these episodes. Every last one of them. That's evil. Period. That's straight up fuck shit.